Oh, welcome back to Jeremy's Adventures. We are doing an inside ride today on Ruby. I'm using a Saurus M2 Smart Trainer. It's a wheel on trainer. And like I said, I've got Ruby rolling on my iPad up here. I ride a mountain bike, Specialized Crave, Vittoria rear trainer tire, designed for wider rims so you don't get blowouts. Works great, good system. A lot of people tend to wonder, can I actually ride a mountain bike on an indoor trainer or does it have to be a road bike? Well, I guess this is the answer right here. I'm doing it and it works just fine. But there are a few limitations. First of all, the noise is a little bit more because you've got a larger contact patch on that tire back there than on a road bike. But that's not the end of the world. Just put it in the basement or don't ride in the middle of the night when other people are sleeping. Whew, pardon me, it's a big hill here. <sighs> Anyways, the other question that people kind of wonder about, and very rightly so, I don't know if you've ever seen someone on, uh, let's say, a downhill one by drive train on a, a fully full squish, full suspension mountain bike. They, they can't go very fast. Downhill, on flat, you'll, uh, you'll cadence out. You'll be spinning too fast to go any faster, even if you got it in your legs and your lungs. So, same thing happens on the trainer. And I've got a two by 10 on my crepe. I never touch the front chain ring, ever. Never need it. And that's not because I'm a great biker, it's just because of this, just because the way this stuff is set up. What I do do is, okay, we're coming up to a hill here. Um, let's look back there. I am about on the middle, whoop, middle sprocket of the cassette. All right, we really got to gear up here, okay? Whew. Going downhill. Hey, reached another level. Anyways, going downhill. Oh, I'm in my highest gear. This is, this is it. I can't go any faster than this if I wanted to. I mean, I'm going pretty fast, but this is it. So can you ride a mountain bike on an indoor wheel-on smart trainer? Absolutely you can. But if you're a pro level biker, you probably will get tired of it pretty quick because you, unlike me, will be topping out all the time because you don't have enough gearing. So if all you got is a mountain bike, throw it on that sucker and just ride, man. You'll have a great time. But if you got two bikes to choose from and one's a road bike, take that all the way any day. Cheers for now. Stay safe, have fun. We'll see you in the next one. Please like and subscribe.